From Interior Alaska's most trusted news source, this is your morning news update with J.R. Lewis. Good morning and thanks for joining us. It's Tuesday, January 6, 2015, and in the news, Senator-elect Dan Sullivan can drop the elect today. His schedule for the morning lists being sworn into office at 8 a.m. Alaska time on the floor of the U.S. Senate. After that, the ceremonial swearing in with Vice President Joe Biden in the old Senate chamber scheduled for 10.30 a.m. Alaska time. Sullivan, who was a Republican, defeated incumbent Democrat Mark Begich in the November general election. Governor Bill Walker has traveled to Washington, D.C. for the swearing in of Dan Sullivan. Walker also plans to meet with Interior Secretary Sally Jewell and is trying to set up other meetings before returning to Alaska tomorrow. The Jewell meeting is said to be mainly introductory, a chance for the two to meet after previously just speaking over the phone. But one issue that could come up is a road through a wildlife refuge from King Cove to Cold Bay, which Walker supports, but Jewell has rejected. And a North Pole man will serve just over four years jail time after an armed standoff with authorities in 2013. 28-year-old Ryan Sparks pleaded guilty to reduce charges of assault on police officers and civilians as part of a plea deal. Sparks shot at Alaska State Troopers when they responded to a report of screaming from inside a residence. It took several hours to get Sparks to surrender without injury. Sparks' attorney attempted to seal evidence regarding the reduced sentence, but Superior Court Judge Paul Lyle declined. Quick look at a chilly Fairbanks weather forecast. Clear skies today, highs 15 to 25 below. Tonight clear and lows 20 to 32 below. Tomorrow clear again with highs 0 to 10 below. Temperatures should average 15 to 30 degrees warmer in the hills. Extended forecast, a little optimism. Mostly clear Thursday, mostly cloudy Friday. Chance of snow this weekend and temperatures starting to rise from about 0 on Thursday to maybe teens above by Sunday. Air index, unhealthy in Fairbanks, very unhealthy in North Pole, and the aurora forecast is moderate. That's all we have for right now. Glad you could join us. And remember, for more news, sports, or weather, you can download our free mobile app for Android and Apple devices. From all of us here at News Center 11, I'm J.R. Lewis. Thanks for watching, and enjoy your day.